Today I have my brand new Meta Quest 3 and we're gonna be magnet fishing through the headset. I am currently recording through my VR headset and I'm standing down by the river. Oh, here we go, there's something on here. Oh, yes, dude. This is literally the exact hubcap we are looking at. What is going on today, guys? Check it out, today we're back down by the river and we're gonna be trying something pretty crazy. Today I have my brand new Meta Quest 3 and they have something called augmented reality. So today we are actually gonna be putting this headset on and we're gonna be magnet fishing through the headset. So I'm actually gonna be showing you guys my view through the headset. I've never done this before. I have no clue what it's gonna look like, but today we're gonna give it a shot. This should be pretty crazy, you guys. Check this thing out, it's got three cameras on the front and basically it just projects everything in the world through the headset so we're gonna give it a shot you guys let's throw this headset on let's start dipping our magnet and let's see if we can find anything here today I am currently recording through my VR headset and I'm standing down by the river I have no clue what this footage is gonna look like until I get home but this looks pretty crazy I can't believe how clear it actually is I am in virtual reality you guys we got Alex magnet fishing over here and check this out I can open menus and stuff with my fingers as we stand in the water here. It's just unbelievable. It almost doesn't even feel real. This is so weird. Like I'm playing real life in a video game. All right, guys, check it out. I got my headset on. I got my magnet. Let's start tossing this thing in the river and let's see if we can find anything magnet fishing on the VR. This looks absolutely insane, man. It almost doesn't even feel real. Here we go, you guys. Magnet fishing with the VR headset. You guys should be able to see everything I see. I think I got something first throw here. Already. Yeah, look at dude. Ooh, what is that you guys? I see some white color. What is this? Oh, I lost track with my headset. Okay, it's back. You guys, no flipping way. Check this thing out. Literally, first throw of the day, first find with the VR headset. I caught me what looks like a little white bowl or like a little white tray. And we got like one of these little circle chip cutout things. Tons of these in here. Unbelievable. Now watch this. As I'm holding this thing, I can open up menus and I could scroll through the internet. It's just absolutely crazy the things you can do with this headset, you guys. We are living in the future. What do you think they were cooking in that one, man? Super cool. Uh-oh, you guys, Alex is stuck on something here. Let's see if we can figure out what's going on. Oh, you really are stuck. Oh, you're like really stuck. Oh, there it goes. Magnet rescue, we got her back. With the VR, I saved your magnet in virtual reality. Oh yeah, that's definitely a bike seat. For sure. Used to connect right there. Super cool, man. Holy cow, that's gotta be like a toy bike yeah, seat or though. Yeah, a tricycle or Yeah, like a there. tricycle. Like, <laughs> yep, definitely not like a real yeah. mountain bike or nothing. <laughs> Pretty cool. Here we go. This is something. Oh yeah, this is decent. Whoa, whoa. What do we got even going on here? This thing looks like it's full of mud, whatever this is. Whoa, look at that. It's like the old roly poly. You guys check this thing out. It almost looks like a, some kind of dryer vent or something like that. Maybe some kind of exhaust vent coming out of like a factory building or off a machine. If we could stick our arm in there. We could use it as some shield. <laughs> Ooh, looks like a little something on the bottom of there, you guys. A couple circle looking plates, but yes, check this thing out. Whoa. What is this fucking looking something? Again, you guys, tons of scrap debris on there. Bunch of fishing line. That's always good to get out of the river. But this thing, I don't know what this could be. It looks like it's got maybe two bolts or screws coming off of there. And then it's got like a little hole outlet down at the bottom. I don't know what to think of this thing, man. Tons of rust, tons of clams on there. What do you guys think this thing is? Oh, here we go. There's something on here. Oh, yes, dude. Whoa. 
What is this hanging off of there too? Check this thing out, you guys. I don't know what that is. Big, ugly chunk of scrap. But you guys, I know what this sucker is. No doubt we just caught us another hubcap. Let's see if we can wash this thing off and see the emblem on this one, you guys. Unbelievable, man. This one here is super dented up. But if you look, there's definitely some blue writing on there. I have no clue what it says though, you guys. I can't even tell. If you guys have seen any video you could pick any single one from this area i'm pretty sure we find at least one hubcap every single time we come out here what a super cool find you guys Aha, I thought I felt some weight on there you guys so I tried to lift it right up and over all the snaggy stuff Look at that, at first I thought it was a wheel. That's definitely some kind of pulley. Super cool, you guys. That's actually a pretty big old pulley. What do you think they were pullying with that one? Some stuff? You guys, check it out. I took my headset off for a minute here to look at it. This thing is absolutely covered in mud, man. But seriously, I cannot imagine the future of these things. If they can make it where this thing is like a contact lens or like a pair of sunglasses instead of a big old clunky headset, that is an absolute game changer. Oh, you guys, I didn't even think there was anything on there but a bunch of junky scrap again. A little stick piece. But check out that fishing lure, man. That's a nice one. That's like the old realistic looking rubber on there. Super cool, man. The hook still looks good and everything. There's like a school bus down there. That's not moving. Whatever that is, is like part of the ground at this point. Oh, man. I don't know. I just grabbed a piece of it. You're lying to me. <laughs> what the heck is this? I literally just grabbed a chunk off of whatever that is. Dude, whoa, you guys. Does that not look like teeth for maybe like some kind of giant saw? You guys, what a super cool find, man. 100%, those are definitely teeth. Or maybe there's some kind of gears like locking mechanism pieces to prevent something from spinning. I don't really know. Oh, I just grabbed something. Please come with me. Keep coming. Is it? Yes, I think so. Oh, it is. Dude, what is this? No, it fell off. It's right by my foot. It's like under my foot. Where did, I, where did that go? I almost want to just stick my arm in and grab it. I'm gonna. I'm not even gonna mess around. That looks shiny. Dude. Oh, score, man. I knew it looked shiny. Heck yeah! Is that even magnetic? Yeah! Whoa! What's on there? Hold on a sec. Before we look at this hubcap, what are these hanging off of there, you guys? Maybe like a white spark plug or some kind of insulator or something? Now we should be recording again. And what I wanted to do was pull up with my internet tab and literally show you guys the exact hubcap that we found. If you look right in the center there, you can see the little Chevy symbols and the Chevy symbols are right here on this one. This is literally the exact hubcap we are looking at. That is so flippin' cool, you guys. And holy cow, man, look at the price. $407 for a set of four of these. Super flippin' cool, you guys. All right, you guys, unfortunately, that is gonna wrap our video up here for today, magnet fishing in virtual reality. What do you guys think? I think 
think it was pretty cool. The idea behind it is definitely the future, especially if they can make it to the point where them things are like a pair of glasses or even like a contact lens. And I'm sure eventually the picture is just gonna get 10 times better. Right now, the video can be a little bit choppy at times, especially towards the end of the video. I turned on my Wi-Fi hotspot and that's how I was able to search the internet and find that hubcap. I think that is so cool, pretty crazy and pretty cool. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. I think it definitely deserves another shot. If you guys enjoyed this video today, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.